another look at uh, Deep Forest from the view of Bewildered Beast starting in P13 Japanese driver behind got Submarine 707 McDaddy Hollow Aim a couple of Japanese drivers in here a lot of Japanese drivers Tuck Giro Noticed uh, even from today's racing the uh, NXX is becoming the go-to car Seems to be very quick through this part of the track Obviously got top end speed as well One of the earlier races that Beast had done. I'll see how everyone plays nice down in the uh, the hairpin. It's a bit of a dive, they'll be under over there. Bit of nickel back here. A couple of Ferraris fighting it out. Nine elevens, which is my favourite car at the moment. Beast back here in eleven. J0 obviously got uh, dealt with in the first lap. McDaddy holds on to P2 with hollow aim. Japanese Porsche driver here. Distinctive sound of the Ferrari. Try and say that one, I'm not going to be baited. Call that one T. Beast up to 10th here now. So we'll go on board. Straight line speed of the Ford. Making quick work of the Porsche. Done the over under trick back on in. So, an early pit there by one of the Japanese drivers. the race a little bit, McDaddy's still holding P2, Apollo goes out to the concrete wall, luckily didn't hit that. So the cars trailing these two are going to be fortunate. Beast might be a little bit too far back to gain any benefit from that. 
in the short term. impact other than let's P5 getting a little bit closer beast up to 8 here now daddy with a quicker slap there 126.8 Another one in for the pit stop here. J0 circulating in the 129s, probably not going to be quick enough overall. now got a penalty deals with that holds P2 beast is right in the mix here now the motor 10 cars up to 7 beast is in 8 chance for sixth here got the speed gonna get boxed in though has to bump draft the Ferrari might a 10 car goes in knocks the Japanese driver Shape here. And Saiba, who's unfortunately Beast had nowhere to go but hit him, Just lets the other Japanese driver back through. Damage on the front there. Front and back damage for the um, Mitre 10 car. So with that, Beast heads to the pits. as does the motor 10 car halfway through the race looks like everyone's doing that strategy oh, so beast is changing tires no fuel likewise motor 10 car changes tires no fuel and the Porsche So if you've seen some of my or my 
video so far I didn't change tyres I was able to do the whole race on the one set this was an I assume this is an early race in the week from Beast so a lot of them probably not knowing what the strategy is or the best strategy would have just opted for that so McDaddy's got the lead here his tyre's quite worn for seven laps so I'm tipping he will probably soldier on until his lap times start to fade and re-evaluate when he gets near the end of the race some more into the pits so those two got a, a great lead here now submarines been in he's also changed tires and back out this driver stayed on the tires but he's picked up a three second penalty for his entry into pit lane crossing the line another one on clean tyres here now, J0 is still at the rear the lead is in so whether he changes tyres, I'd say he will ah, oh, made a liar out of me in and out whereas the AMG driver changes tyres so submarine goes by back into P2 so submarines circulating in just at the 127s we'll see what happens to McDaddy now that he's going to carry on with uh, some tyres in used condition Submarine's got hollow, keeping him busy. Oh, a bit of a tap there. So front and back damage here on this uh, Porsche. Front damage on hollows AMG. gets the spot So 
they still got a decent gap there. Aim with a penalty there, Beast now up into sixth. Got past this Ferrari. Porsche battle going on here. So aim on the warm tyres. Still able to make the move. Gets a little bit of a tap from behind. Escaped another penalty there, it's only just, maybe because of the tap that uh, gave them the benefit of the doubt. Another Ferrari driver with a penalty, that's just about bugger their race as far as going any better. serves his little half second penalty the other Japanese driver here gets the move done they go over this jewel again so into the first turn again aim gets the Spot. Oh, the Japanese driver's really giving a hip and shoulder out there. Beast will be loving this from his vantage point. So, talking of that, we'll go on board. He's right on the back of AIM here now. So, it'd be interesting to see on the back straight whether the legs of the uh, the Ford will get him up in front of this guy. This corner is crucial for him. He's good. Force driver doesn't get a penalty for there. I'd be very surprised. They're all over the curb. He's going to slip down here. Yeah, it's sort of been. Here we go. Force driver goes very deep on brakes. Pulls it up though. Is he getting bumped off track? Yes, he is. Dirty play. Well done, Beast. You get in for fourth. And Daddy got one. Hollow for two. The other Japanese driver, Beast, aim. Two more Japanese drivers. Mata 10 gets across the line in 8. Japanese driver for 10. Submarines had a big problem. They've finished in 11th. Just in front of J0. No, they've decided to finish last. Bizarre. Thanks for watching.